help the family if we all in our own way just give praise to God for being the mighty God who is so
but it's even more difficult when we try to handle it by ourselves. <laughs> and it's good to know that no matter what we face in life, Amen. Amen. Especially the death of a significant loved one, no matter what we face in life, we don't have to face it by ourselves. And we don't have to face it in our own strength. Amen. The Old Testament reading, Isaiah 40, verse 28, says, Have thou not known? Have thou not heard? That the everlasting God, the Lord, the creator of the ends of the earth, he fainteth not. Amen. Neither is weary. There is no searching of his understanding. He giveth power to the faith. Amen. And to them that have no might, he increased strength. Even though the youth shall faint and be weary. Amen. And the young men shall utterly fall. But they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. Yes, uh, yes. They shall mount up with wings as Amen. eagles, and they shall run and not be weary, and they shall walk and not faint. Amen. It's good to know that we can change our weaknesses yeah. for His strength. Amen. Amen. New Testament reading. Revelation is 21. Verses 1 through 5. And I saw a new heaven and a new earth. Yeah. For the first heaven and the first earth were passed away, and there were no more sea. And I, John, saw the holy city, New Jerusalem, coming down from God out of heaven, prepared as a bride adorned for her husband. And I heard a great voice out of heaven saying, Behold, the tabernacle of God is with men. And he will dwell with them, and they shall be his people. And God himself shall be with them, and be their God. And God shall wipe away all tears from their eyes. And there shall be no more death, neither sorrow, nor crying, neither shall there be any more pain. For the former things are passed away. And he that sat upon the throne said, Behold, I make all things new. And he said unto me, Write, for these words are true and faithful. May God have a blessing to the hearers and the doers of his written word. Amen. Amen.
Our Father. Our Father. The one who sits high in the globe. The one who has all authority and all power. Our Father. You are the Father of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. You are the great I Am. You're the first and the last, the beginning and the ending. You're Alpha and Omega, our Father. Today, our Father, we recognize you. Even now, as Jehovah, as Jehovah Sikhanu, as Jehovah Reha, you are Jehovah Jireh. Today, you are yet still our provider. Then, Lord, we shall look toward the hills from which cometh all of our help. All of our help shall come from thee. For you are El Shaddai. You are Almighty God. You're sovereign. You can do what you want to do. When you want to do it and how you want to do it. Now, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, forgive us of our sins, every one of our transgressions, created us a clean heart, renew a right spirit within us. Lord God, if we falter along the way, please, sir, don't be angry with us. Dust us off and pick us up, for we're willing to run on and see what the end shall be. Oh God, great Jehovah, have mercy in this place today. Let thou anointing be fresh in the house. Let it touch now this family. I pray under the anointing of the Holy Ghost that your anointing will remind the family that to live is for Christ, but to die is the game. To be absent from the body is to be present with you. Touch them right now, oh God. Remind them that you're too wise to make a mistake. You are too just to do us wrong. And that some bad morning when this life is over, everything's gonna be all right. Now, Lord, can I close my prayer without telling you thank you for the word today. Touch the preacher who shall preach your unadulterated word. When the word shall go forward, let sinners come running. Let silence come home. Strengthen the Christian. For if we ever needed you, we shall need you now. Now, Lord, God, I tell you thank you for my laying down last night. Thank you for my other rising this morning. Thank you, oh God, that when I got up this morning, I was clothed in my right mind. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you right now for your son, Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father, for your son who died one Friday, but early on the third day, he rose again with all power. All power. All power. All power in his hand. And Lord God, because he lives, face tomorrow. Because Jesus lives, everything's going to be alright. Because Jesus lives, we've been made to a fortnight. But joy will come in the morning. Yes, Lord. In Jesus' name. Amen. Oh, 
just nudge somebody and tell them he's singing to you. Self-pity Make it turn 